What's going on YouTube? Benable Straw is back with a public service announcement video. If you guys are playing this new event here, the new event, the Red Dead rematch, and you guys go into the challenge, of course, it lets you use anybody, right? But after you complete it, there's still more missions left to do. In the story, there isn't, like, there's still some zombie juggernaut shards, there's still some zombie Iron Man shards, and there's even still some hella shards in there. I noticed this while I was, um, while I was doing the event, of course. Just autoed right through it, didn't really even have to think about it. But when, uh, when I went to go looking through, you know how in the storyline they allow you to test the characters, they allow you to sort of see how they function in the actual game modes themselves. See, we just finished this mission here. Now, when we, of course, very nice, four red Zugs, very, very, very good. But when we go into it and we go to the storyline section, it's not, it's not auto-completing the one before. So you definitely want to go and tell your friends about this one because it is very, very, very important and you don't want to miss out on these shards. Let's go check it out. So here in the challenge, of course, we got the four red zombie juggernaut, and then all of these are the exact same, so you'll be able to run your 50s on that. Not necessarily sure if you guys are going to be able to get zombie Scarlet Witch, like you really have to get lucky on some of those drops, but it's looking absolutely awful for that. So after completing the middle challenge one where all the characters are allowed, you still want to go here where the story is and claim your 50 Hela, your 50 Zombie Juggernaut, and your 50 Iron Man Zombie. You don't want to miss out on these shards at all. Simply because we never, re we don't really know where Zombie Juggernaut's going to be going. So I, I just wanted to make this video so you guys can sort of get an idea of what what to do for this event because this can go overlooked because typically in these events you when you finish the second side it gives you the first time rewards for the first side but that's not that's not necessarily the case for this one so i just wanted to make this video for you guys just to inform you that there are some extra shards in the storyline um but that's about it for this video short sweet and to the point let me know if this video helped any of you guys, and thank you so much for watching, and I will catch all of you guys in the next one.